Good morning, little Timmy. What's up, baby? Look, you fuzzy as fuck, nigga. Oh, wait a minute. That ain't supposed to be there. Y'all know we a mess, so don't be expecting nothing now. Coming in this motherfucker with expectations and judgment and shit. We ain't here for that. We just not here. I don't know. I'm not doing that. I'm I not doing Nobody got time for you. Get you early for this shit. Oh, shit. About That's that. right. You don't have no time. We don't, we don't care. We don't have no time for it. We don't have none of that. Yeah. So it is uh, way too early for anyone's shit this morning. Good morning, whoever has joined the party. Welcome to the party and good morning to you. Good morning. So I, I uh, watched yesterday when they see us. Oh my God, little Timmy. And I tell you, I was. Oh, wait a minute! No sound! No sound! No sound! I was completely and absolutely devastated by it. I was really messed up. That thing is so deep. If you haven't, um, if you haven't seen it, you've got to see it. And and like, I really didn't even want to watch it, Timmy. Really? I didn't want to watch. I wanted to, but I couldn't, man. I mean, initially, I had to work through my daggone emotions. Yeah. You know? Two. Have you seen it yet? I'm I'm, I'm on part one. They watch part two. It's just a, I guess. So part one was what really had me all tripped out, right? Yeah. Part one was crazy. Good morning, Donna. Welcome to the party. Good I morning. Think they, I think you the kids' lives. You know I don't mean? know. How could you ruin my life like that? And, and and people like to think that to think that that is just not unusual, right? It's just not unusual for uh, white people. And the dad's response was clearly indicative of the fact that that kind of thing went on. Did you, I don't know if you've seen it, but uh, you already seen part one. You said, yeah. So how they had the man in there and asked him to leave. You know what I mean? Asked yeah. the woman to leave, the mother mm -hmm. in the precinct. Listen, I was so emotional. I I, I went live. Good morning, uh, Algiers. How you doing, honey? Hey, I went up? live. D listen, we're going to ask people. Can you send Algiers the link? Algiers, uh, I want you to come on here if you've seen when you see when they see us because I went live to talk about it because I was so emotional like I, I didn't know how to process how I was feeling. Mm -hmm. It was so bad, man. The grandmother, yeah, Monroe, the grandmother who didn't speak English, you know, came and and she because I think that if those animals who are the police and the prosecutors and all of the other people who uh, perpetuated this these these crimes against humanity? Because that's exactly what it was. Nothing less. This this was mm. awful. These were like assaults. This was some terrorist shit. Yeah. Okay. Let's just call it what it was. It was like we we've been under terrorist attacks as a black race in America for decades. Mm -hmm. Listen, when I tell you that. Um, I couldn't I couldn't process how I felt about it responsibly. I was like, that bitch needs to die. It's awful. They shouldn't be alive. That kind of thing. Yeah. Um, it was just bad. It was bad. Let's see, uh, Big Dale. Big Dale coming around. Oh. Big Dale. Big Dale, can you hear us? He just staring at his phone for me. Big Dale, can you hear us? Yeah, I can hear you. Well, why the hell you ain't saying nothing then? Hey, what's okay, up? So we, yeah, how y'all feeling? What's up, bro? We talking about when when you see when they see us. Did you see it? Oh, okay. No, I still had a chance to look at them. Uh, you know, um, Atlanta Housewives had 24 episodes. Okay. You don't need to okay. Anyway, little Timmy, let's bring Big Dale back when he got something to say. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have no real contribution. 
<laughs> That's what happens when you don't take your Metamucil early. So. <laughs> That's for sure. Yeah, but no, it was a, it was a, you know, that time. That's how I was back then, though. In that time period, a lot of innocent kids, a lot of innocent people got locked up back then. A lot of innocent people, you know. It wasn't even that long ago. You know, I know it wasn't that long, but back then, that's where I was, though. And then back then, that's why a lot of people got off because DNA came into play later, later years later. People they saw DNA, and for a lot of people didn't do it because DNA testing became popular. But did you see how she continued? What you doing, Big Dale? Um, getting, getting stuff still set up. I'm listening to y'all, though. I can hear you on, on my phone. Did you see how they... Big Dad, I'm going to take you and try to talk to him. Sit in the lobby for a minute. Just be in the lobby. Hey, time out, nigga. <laughs> Natty nigga chatty. He chatty as fuck in the lobby. Yeah, but the old nigga on time out. Time yeah. out, nigga. Did you see how... <laughs> You should see his mouth moving and everything. This nigga that got put out the party. Yeah. We're going to bring you back, boo. Just you got to spend it, nigga. Did you see how uh, the grandmother like was there? She was protective over, over her grandson, who was the Latino. And the mother was like, you know, mother, mother, mother cub. But the little boy whose mom got sick and had to leave. Mm-hmm was the smallest of all three of them, the one they tried to put the whole thing on. Right. But the lady decided, when she came in there and saw a room full of black kids, she decided that she was going to make somebody in that room the culprit. Oh, yeah. She said, yeah. Wake, them up. wake them up and get them in interrogation. Yeah. She kept even after the guy admitted to the well, you don't you haven't gotten to that. But well, I, even, heard, I, I heard about the whole thing. But yes, I, I, I remember the case. Quit. I remember it. I remember when it happened. I remember the whole case when it happened. Hey, good morning, Ed. Welcome to the party, sir. Good morning, good morning. Like and share this feed. Listen, we here each and every weekday morning. I was ready to say Monday through Friday. Weekday morning. We're going to do 1030. So, because 1010 ain't working out for us. We're going to do 1030 ish. Let's be honest. 1030 ain't working out for us. <laughs> Let's go with it. Is. Here comes Big Dale coming back to the Monday, Monday, Friday. Weekday morning. We're going to do 1030. So, because 1010 ain't working out for us. We're going to do. <laughs> okay. So, listen. Anyway, the. The prosecutor, even after she knew that the man was innocent, mm. decided that, um, can you stabilize your camera, sir? Decided that she was going to continue and, and made the guy who confessed the sixth person. Right. What I understand, he said he did it. He, he admitted the whole thing. You no, know, he told them everything. He gave them the facts. These boys didn't even know where the crime happened. They placed the crime in the wrong location in the park. And they just disregarded all of that They edited the confession video. Now, when the fuck do you edit um, do you edit uh, what do you call it, Timmy? The police. Uh, yeah, for David. Huh? No. Yeah, yeah for no. David. The confession? Yeah, but what is it? What is it when you have stuff? Evidence. 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 That becomes evidence. How the fuck do you edit evidence? I mean, they, 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 they edit evidence. They edit, they edit evidence on OJ. That, that ain't hard to do. Agree. What do you mean they edit the evidence on OJ? Man, they're going to do what they want to do with that. Let me tell you something. You ain't see the whole OJ thing where they had, they had the shoes and the trunk for a fucking week and a half, and then decided to bring them out and say, oh, yeah, we got these shoes they found. That's what she tried trunk. to do. She tried to do the same thing with um the uh the sock with the semen in it. Yeah. The sock, so the, the, the real rapist had semen in a sock that he left on the crime scene. They found that and held it and said they were going to hold it. That's the dumbest shit. Hold it until... 
they got closer to that point in the trial and used it as investigation. This bitch was stupid, okay? Yeah, she was, she was nothing short of stupid. Yeah, because you, I mean, you, how can, you can't hold evidence like that. You no, hold evidence like that, automatically gets thrown out. Exactly. It's thrown out automatically. Now, both of y'all in law enforcement, right? Y'all got law enforcement background. What, what now would somebody do if, if uh, the evidence was tampered with? Like even on audio, you can't, like that becomes evidentiary fact, right. in the, correct? Right, correct. So you can't just go in and edit the audio to make it work for you, right? Oh, not nowadays, no. I mean, when could you? Not supposed to. Back then, you probably could. I mean, and and, and they get and get away with it, but not now. They, they edited their voices out of the video. They edited the fact that they were telling these boys what to say, and it was just bananas. Yeah, but you gotta then, know, baby. Back, I mean, you say you say it wasn't that long ago, but a lot of a lot has changed since then. A lot, a lot has changed. Has changed since then, but that was 1989, and that speaks to the fact that all of these wrongful incarcerations. Where there were cases, uh, Ava DuVernay also did the movie 13. Did you guys see that? Yeah, so about the 13th Amendment. Now, all of the evidentiary information and the facts and all of that stuff in this particular case created a space for them to be exonerated when, in fact, they used it to actually imprison these boys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. These motherfuckers were literally in the interrogation room forcing these kids to say shit. They they interrogated them without a parent present. All of them were underage. Yeah. So 16 by law is adult? Yeah, uh, no, uh, no, uh, 16, well, it depends. You can go to jail at 14, depending on the crime. If the crime is a, a felony, you could be uh, charged as an adult at 14. So 16, if you charge, if you, it's the way you charge, if they charge you with a felony as an adult, you can go to jail. They charged him as an adult because it was a felony. Hmm. That's why. All right. Well, okay. You know what I, mean? I just, I, I, I think that you guys have to feel. We'll talk more about it once you've seen it. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna it up today. When they see us, that's an interesting name too. Yeah. They are, I need you to focus on the screen. Stop looking sideways. We don't want to see. Damn, nigga, that's your phone on my way, nigga. I have to have to have to have to. That's Nikki's phone because I have to communicate with her because she's gonna spend thirty minutes talking about this one subject right here. <laughs> We're saying, oh yeah, huh? You got yeah, you got to put the capitalize. Bitch, move on. <laughs> <laughs> She all into it, trying to use big words. She tried to use big words and shit. Talk about she she got to understand who her co-host is. I know. Huh? I never say ever, ever did you ride. Like I, you know, <laughs> right, right. I know, I know you hurt your lip saying is that. that new, your tongue bleeding. <laughs> is that a new? Is that a new cereal? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah better be. I think it's something. You two, you got boys. Yeah. Uh, Ma say we should have been married since 1989. The media does it, does its own anger management on us. I know that's right, dude. Man, that's sure. right. Say it again. Yeah. Yeah, that's real talk. Mm -hmm. That's real talk. That's real talk. Like I said, man, All right, so we did. Back then, huh? Back, like I said, back then, it was rough back then. You know, that was coming off that like circle go time. When they was just they were so corrupt, like New York was really corrupt back then, really corrupt. If you ever seen the movie Serpico? Well, New York was really Al Pacino, man. That'll tell you. And that's before the that's before the heavy um, social media presence and you know phone cameras and all that. So yeah. you know now now it's a little different. So it's a little harder for them to, to hide the truth because there's so many different truths out there with different phone cameras and right. people filming everything now. So back then they couldn't. You you didn't have that. You didn't have that outlet. We didn't have that outlet. Now, but like like my man said, the media, they always try to find something to suppress what we're thinking about to put something else in our mind to talk about. Yeah. Some other bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, something else something going on with Trump, they throw the Bill Cosby shit or the R. Kelly shit up on the news. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Who knows to Ava DuVernay, man? She she really she did that. She did that movie in a way that made everybody, you know, feel and and go back to that time. 
And that wasn't, again, I gotta say, it wasn't that fucking long ago. It's awful, man. Them dudes lost their whole lives. My heart aches every time I think about it. And so many right. of men in this country just like it. I know a guy, um, Jimmy, somebody got an echo. Ain't me. Ain't me. All I got is this phone on. Okay. Anyway. It might be that see through mic you're using. No, it's not the mic. It's it's one of y'all. It's coming through the feed. But uh, he he was wrongfully incarcerated in West Virginia, and they knew they literally changed the evidence on him. They changed the. He wasn't on the scene. He didn't have no anything involved. He eventually went on to win his case against them, but he spent uh, 27 years in jail for a crime he knew he did. And the only reason he's out is because he, he kept fighting. You know, imagine all the guys who gave up the fight, man. The families gave up the fight. God damn, I can't think. I can't, I can't. It's just awful. It's awful. Anyway, we're going to move on because that is heavy. And that shit is wearing me down. So, Jamie said, why are you always in the car now moving? Because you driving the goddamn bus. He said he ain't going nowhere long as you driving the fucking bus out there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. We lost little Timmy. Mm. Little Timmy go. He back. He froze him. I'm in. He back. He, said, I'm in. <laughs> he tried to start his car. Little Timmy, what are you doing? <laughs> he said, I'm here. I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to Timmy? He tried to start that car. That motherfucker's car took off. Can't do too, the car can't do too many things at one time. Yeah, then the phone can't be working and it can't uh, crank it at the same time. If you show us match the start button, Timmy, when you try to crank it, match the start button and hold it on your phone, then crank the car. <laughs> I don't know what's happening with little Timmy. He keeps coming back and forth. I'm here. I'm here present. What, what the fuck is going on with the camera, Timmy? I don't know. Let me see. There you oh, go. Where you got it? Huh? What there you the go. Is you in there getting my wipe, wipe the lens, Timmy. Wipe the lens. <laughs> no, get your fingers off the lens. There you go. There we go. Get on, little this, Timmy. I hate is that, is that juice? Oh, that's my phone. Oh, that was high. Phone. Oh. My phone got hot. I was like, damn, that nigga went heavy on that scary juice. It must be a cute crackhead around there. <laughs> my phone got hot. Good morning. Good morning, Clarence. Welcome to the party. Bree said Timmy has Comcast Wi Fi. <laughs> you ain't even here, Bree. That's the time. Hey. This nigga using somebody else's Comcast. Definitely, hey. definitely, fan. Don't forget to like and share this feed. Please tell a friend to come join us every day, Monday through Friday, from, from 10 30 ish to um, 11 30 ish. We'll be in there around that sometime, right before you take your lunch break, so you can have like you working and looking at us at the same time. Then go take your lunch break. Hey, Jamie, good point. Jamie says the movie was marvelous. That's why you, my blood boil when I see and hear these Negro acting like animals. You're exactly right. You're yeah. exactly all, all we endure. We still act like animals. Can we go on again? No, no man. He, is he froze? Oh, no, no, he there. This is how you breathe. Mm -hmm. You gotta I'm stop. If you're gonna look at your computer, put it in front of you, okay? Because hey, hey, every Del. camera, y'all, because we a fucking mess. This hey, is the producer, and the producer got his right. child, so we keep seeing his shit and all this bullshit. Put the shit in front of you, so you. Can I got here. you. I, I got you. I'm trying. I'm trying to do 18 things at one time with y'all. Just do one, Nick. Just be on the show. Okay? Stop wearing. Stop wearing tank top. Don't do that shit. That's what I'm talking about, little Timmy. We don't want to see your fucking nigga. Don't, nigga, nigga, you go to uh fucking rock bodies, fuck brick bodies, nigga. You shit like a rock. <laughs> okay, I don't need, I don't need hear Timmy. You don't. Well, well I'm I your ass up. Huh? We can hear Timmy. So I can come back. Here. Oh man, Timmy going for a long ride. He been oh, on the road for a trip. You see me? You hear me again? Wrangling junkies, y'all. But listen, I want to talk about one other thing. Sure. Okay, so Queen B and Jay Z. Now look at the uh, the feed right here. Queen uh, B and Jay Z were 
at a game. Jimmy, that's true. Uh, that's the Jumpies. That was the Jumpies. They, they, they ain't me driving the damn truck. It's a truck on the street. Oh, that was a truck. Okay. I didn't know what the fuck it was. It was scary, nigga. It was scary. Anyway, uh, Queen B at a game, and this chick decides that she's going to keep on reaching over her. Just watch B's face if you can see it. Watch her reaction to this bra. Look, look at her face. It's all kind of scary. It's scary. They ain't feeling that shit. Look, look. Polite. Polite. Watch this, though. She, you see her hit her with the she she hit her with the shoulders. She like say it with your shoulders. Move, bitch. Move, bitch. Move, bitch. Move, bitch. Move. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? Yeah. You know what though? I know. I know. If you if, if you get caught cheating and another girl talk to you, you scared of shit. Then when the H town came out right there, <laughs> she's like, okay, enough you is know, enough. She was like, enough oh, is he, 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 But Beyonce like this. Really, you okay? One thing is okay. Okay, but don't yeah. keep trying to have a whole conversation with this nigga while I'm sitting here, bitch. You and we know, trying to watch the game. She got the drunk breath and all of that. Come on now. Yeah. I'm trying to enjoy the game with my man. My man trying to enjoy the game. You want to carry on a whole conversation about some whole other shit. You know, hey, people don't uh, understand like celebrities are human too, so they just want to enjoy themselves as well sometimes. You know what I'm saying? They don't want no, to always nigga. interact and always want to ask 10,000 questions. The whole album was about him cheating, nigga. I'm like, bitch, you better stop. You heard, you heard Lemonade, bitch? You better get away from me. <laughs> no, but the, the lady was the wife of uh, NBA Warriors owner. And she like, Beyonce don't give a fuck. She don't, I don't care who she is, bitch, move. Yeah. Move. That nigga got caught cheating. You can't say nothing to Jay-Z. Mm-mm. It ain't about him cheating. Nobody gets no. fucked. When cheating. you get caught That's cheating, cheating, you feel oh. uncomfortable because you're like, no, bitch, I got caught once. No, oh, he's a billionaire now. Who cares? Nah, no, Jay-Z was engaging her because he said, like, okay, nobody give a fuck. Yeah. Right. And he even he even tried to look away and talk to somebody else, like, hey, what's up, man? What's going on? Ah! Both of them did. Still kept talking. Both of them did. And then Beyonce had to go ahead and hit her with the Houston shoulder. You saw her do the Houston on him. <laughs> it's moving. Uh, go on ahead head. now. Go on, go on ahead. <laughs> that bitch did a duggy on her. Teach me how to duggy. Yeah, Beyonce had to go in on that bitch, though. She was like getting ready to get it. She, yeah. you know. I'm being polite now. Don't make me fuck you up out here. Mm -mm. Right. Let me tell y'all. So, why y'all just staring like that? We're looking at you, nigga. Looking at you. We try, we try to see you shake your shoulders again because it you shakes your breasts at the same. There you go. Looking at you playing with your breasts. There we go. Trying to put, trying to put the microphone in between your titties. What is you doing? <laughs> I'm standing with my shoulders. Soft, soft porn in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all so nasty. It's never too early for that shit. What? <laughs> it's never too early for that shit. <laughs> Y'all are disgusting. What's going on, Timmy, this weekend? No, nah, I'm I'll be in New York this nah, weekend. No, Timmy, somebody that came in the room, she seen she got them putting the breasts all on camera. Ain't nobody in the room yet. Yeah, whatever. You know Del Nasty. You better give him something before you die. Del, I got to do that. What you, you got? Down, nigga, down top of Del. Let me tell y'all something, though. Yeah, I, this, is, this is funny, not funny. But y'all know I'm a kid and my brother is sick. And, like, last few days, he had been, like, really, really in a bad space, right? Mm -hmm. So, we had um, a friend come by. And it was a female, and all of a sudden, this nigga got life. <laughs> I ain't saying she gave him some or nothing, but whatever she touched on that nigga, pull him back. <laughs> okay, this nigga is back. He's somewhat back. I'm telling you, pussy is amazing. <laughs> Even the promise of pussy, it don't even have to actually be no pussy. Just the promise of pussy is an amazing thing. I hey, think man, let me tell you something. something to live for. I'm, I'm, tell you, I'm, speaking, I'm, I'm speaking from experience. I might get it. 
but <laughs> I'm speaking from experience. I'm down for like four weeks. I'm in, I'm in a house. I ain't really supposed to be doing a lot of movement and stuff. I'm down for four weeks. If a motherfucker wink at me hard, I'd be happy than a motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, you had a flu. You had a flu. You had a flu, nigga. Huh? Oh, oh, you want like, like, oh, like that now when you were shaking your breath like that, I, I almost dropped the phone. <laughs> so you can hit it on the replay, nigga. Hit it on the replay. <laughs> <laughs> that's, 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 that's for you. That's, that's, that's why you. I never made a Hey, look! Yeah, I'm, about call, I'm about to call. I'm about to call. I'm about to call insurance. Come and tell her. Yeah, send one of them nurses by uh, twice a week, please. And you I know I turned it down. Way. I know hey. I turned it down at the beginning, but yeah, send me a nurse by twice a week. Hello, move your nut. <laughs> <laughs> Just shift your nut to the left side, please. Please, please shift your nut. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. But please make please make sure the nurse name is Peaches. Okay, so. <laughs> Anyway, wait, we got one more thing that we were going to talk about yesterday, right? And we didn't get a chance to because little Timmy was having all kinds of ideological issues. So we went on and, and moved on to something else. But my girl, Lil' Kim, Lil' Kim was accused of doing insurance fraud, okay? Really? And, huh? Really? Yeah, Lil' Kim. Lil' Kim. So apparently one of the plastic surgeons who did this to her, I'm going to show y'all, who did this to Lil' Kim decides that Lil' Kim needs to pay for that shit. And Lil' Kim said, fuck that, I'm not paying. And he accused her of claim getting the money and not giving it to him. Mm -hmm. But I tell you what. I said this before and I'll say it again. If anybody do that shit to me, made me look like that right there, yeah. that's, me. Fuck you yeah. that's like getting a bad nail job. You're yeah. not getting this. I'm not, I'm not doing it. That feels like a process. Yeah, that's, that's, like a that's, that's horrible. That's it. That, that's, like a that is insurance fraud. He's responsible for them, but I'm going to tell you right now, that right there, mm -mm. That right yeah, she, 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 should be, she should be able to sue for uh, insurance no. fraud, malpractice, everything. That, that she like she can cake batter. She's <laughs> 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 She do. She like she eat raw cookie though. Look at that bitch. That face. shit horrible, man. I hate it. And I used to love Lil' Kim. Yeah, I used to love Lil' Kim when I was young. I used to think she was just, just a cute, little, sexy, hardcore rapper. And she was. Now, she look, now she look like a grandmama cooking in the kitchen. She did. I don't think she looked that bad. With a You don't think she looked that bad? I don't think she looked that bad. No, that's not, that's, that's, no, that's not a recent picture. That's not a recent picture. You seen person. her in person? That's not a recent picture. I've seen her. No, I haven't seen her in person. You seen her in person? Uh -huh. No, that yeah. bitch. Her, her ass looked like one of those um, big puppy things that's on the back of a cricket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. She horrible, man. She does. Like she drinks lead water. You know, you know how you know. Hey, Tim, you know how you see a woman and, and she fire got there. Your shit might got there. Get a little plump. Mm -hmm. My motherfucking dick went inside when he seen her. Uh, my, not, dick, my dick folded up and went inside. Not, <laughs> not cake batter. <laughs> That's that face, honey. That's that face. She looked terrible, man. Yeah. I mean, like I said, she was fine as shit. That, I'm saying that bitch like she's doing glue. She That's did she look terrible. Fine, and that was the problem. She was not feeling fine, okay? She was feeling some other thing. Yeah, she looked terrible. Yeah. Don't and do that. That's good. Hey, Del. I'm, try, I'm trying not to talk over you Timmy, but I can't tell when he's talking because I can't see so him. so lonely. All I see is I'm me lonely. and you. Look at the nigga. Hey, lonely. <laughs> so lonely. Why can't you see Timmy? He's not. He's not. He's not in the room with us. He's on. He's on my computer screen, but I don't want to turn that on because I get feedback. I'm his so That's why. That's why I keep looking, trying to see when he's talking, but it's a delay. So I'm just all off. Well, stop this thing. Tell me stop this. Tell me this thing. Tell me stop this bullshit right here. This is, I love man. I'm so lonely. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's happening over here. But yep. anyway, as I said before. We're here each and every weekday morning. We're going to go with 10.30-ish from now on. What do you think, boys? Yeah. Sounds good. 
I think 10 30 seems to be that's closer to the wrong time. That's closer to the wrong time. We're in the wrong time. That's the right time. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't gonna never have no right time. <laughs> no, watch up. My problem is, tell everybody to stop clocking us. Mind your fucking business. Just turn the goddamn thing on around. Mind your business. It's y'all fault. Expect the shit from us. <laughs> Timmy, Timmy, traveling tomorrow. You traveling tomorrow? What, what's going on for tomorrow? Yeah. Now, my son, my son graduate from uh, middle school tomorrow. Uh uh-uh. uh. What the hell is he saying? You like he's saying something funny. Wait, uh uh-uh. uh. No. Monroe, Monroe, thank you. Hold on, we gotta go back to that comment. Bring that comment back. First, uh, Bree said Big Dale is getting bored. <laughs> then Monroe said he is giving the. I love men. Hey. <laughs> and nigga, and nigga, he ain't getting bored. The nigga old, he can't, can't concentrate. What? What'd you say, Timmy? Huh? What did you say? You can't be in the country. No, nah, Bree, I'm just having technical difficulties difficulties over here. I can't I can't hear Timmy in the in the in the feed unless uh, I look at the screen, but then it's delayed by like 10 seconds. The nigga got diabetes and Parkinson's. So I can't I can't hear what I can't I can't hear the conversation with Timmy. You don't have all I hear is me. All I hear is me and you. Well so when I I look at the screen, I can tell he's talking, but I can't hear what he's saying because if I turn the screen on, I get feedback. But you don't have your Bluetooth or headphones or nothing. So next time no, he's not like 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 yesterday, he will be on the screen with you. He's not on the screen with us now. It's like when me and you talking right now, he's not on the screen with us. It's just me and you on my I'm phone. I'm a ghost, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a ghost, nigga. Some more, that, some more of that too early for this shit, technical difficulty type stuff. You know how I go. <laughs> That's why I was saying I'm trying not to talk over Timmy because I can't tell when he's talking. <laughs> <laughs> we are the most unprepared Man, Ever. <laughs> he he all got. You know, he he came he came he came back to stay creek. Wait. That's why when you brought me on, his phone dropped, you know, just too much going on at one time. His phone here. We're gonna one day one day this show gonna be perfect, boy. No, it ain't. One day this show gonna be no, perfect. It <laughs> no, it ain't. That's the day it gets canceled. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm about to say. That's when the day don't nobody show up. And listen to us, cause that shit gonna be perfect. <laughs> they gonna be like, "Fuck this." <laughs> that nigga ain't that funny. He all right. He all right. <laughs> the most nah, funny Timmy, Timmy fun. show ever. Nah, Timmy, Timmy right. fun is funny. All right, Timmy man. We gonna be all Timmy built in by December. It's eleven eleven, and it's time to get the fuck out. Right. Of here. Yeah, it's time. It's time to get out of here, man. Hey, don't forget, I, I always let me say goodbye before Timmy start talking so I can know. I don't know who's saying what, but let me just say thank y'all for joining us. Don't forget to like and share this feed, man. We appreciate each and every one of y'all hanging out with us every week. You know what I'm saying? I've been, I, I usually be in the back chilling, but I'm in the front hanging with the folks today. But I enjoy my loving the devil, and we love each and every one of y'all. We thank y'all for following, but each and every day, 10 30 ish. 11-ish, somewhere around in there. You know, shit ain't on time because we the most prepared, unprepared show in the motherfucking world. And we love y'all to death. Thank y'all for joining us. Because what? Because what? Because we the most unprepared, prepared. Okay, bye, nigga. You can't. Bye, nigga. Talk to a nigga. Get your ass out of here. Uh, then, 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 like he snore, he, like he snore baby, like he snore baby aspirin. That's the equivalent like, of Martin slamming the door on a motherfucker. Okay, bye, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> so tomorrow I'll, I'll be around early. We got to do early tomorrow. My son graduated from, from middle school tomorrow. So. Oh wow! Okay. So excited about that. Do they still do that? They still have middle school graduations. Yeah, he going to high school. Yeah. And he graduated. Huh? He's graduating? Yeah. Okay. What grade is that? Eighth grade? Yeah, going to the ninth. Who the fuck goes to an eighth grade graduation? Only parents. Uh, only uh, people call parents, Nikki. Nobody <laughs> going to be there. <laughs> like, okay. Shit. So what time is the graduation? Graduation in the evening, but I get him prepared. So I'm, mm-hmm. I'm crying already. Emotional. 
Not because he graduated, but I got to pay more tuition next year. Fuck this. I ain't working. Oh, she's staying at school all year. Was that cry? Megan. Let me see a tear. I told him the other day, once you go to public, if I give you a gun, once you just go to public school. <laughs> he don't want to do that, though. He don't want to do that. Shut up, boy. I can't stand you. I said, look. We'll count, tell you, we'll tell you like blue red pictures. Count in uh drug evidence right now. <laughs> if if Timmy had right. three nipples and <laughs> Tommy had seven guys, what would he get shot? <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what I told him. Up. That's what I told him. I said, look, what color you like blue or red? Pick a gang. Pick a gang. Yeah, but now nah, my tuition going up a lot this year, so I'm be. Is he going so to private good. school? Yeah, of course. Okay. Well, send that nigga to public school. That's the problem. Nah, he was in the public school. They ain't be on, if I was in the public school, he'd be on the street with us. <laughs> <laughs> this is what public school gets you, nigga. Oh, everybody this, in the can't be under nigga, a nigga, <laughs> like daddy. Nigga, this, is, this is a public school goddamn show. This is what you get with your public school. Right here. <laughs> College, this should be all professional, clean, backdrop. This is a public school show. <laughs> it is. It is, little Timmy. Right. You know, even my bra showing. You know, you only right. see that kind of shit in public school. You can't get that everywhere. You think right. when her bra showing? Hell no. <laughs> yeah. Come no, here. No. When you, you ain't got nowhere out. to go, though, little Timmy, you are just right for us. <laughs> this is where you come when it ain't nothing else happening in the world. Okay, this you come true. because it's too early for this shit. For this shit, ain't nobody. All else. right, baby. Holla, love you. So we'll be right. here tomorrow. You say we gotta do early. We're gonna do ten thirty. All right. We'll see y'all at ten thirty tomorrow. You heard it here, okay? All right. Love if you. If nothing else. If nothing else, just know it's too early for this shit. So we out of here. Peace. Bye, little Timmy. Little Timmy frozen. Bye-bye.